Oh, he was, uh, he saw some crazy cases. He teaches now at, uh, the University of Tennessee. I guess so, like, terrible orange, but, uh, he teaches at the body farm at UT. He teaches all kinds of, like, all right, do you, do you know details about the body farm? The no. state of Tennessee, when you die, you can yeah, donate. Explain what the body farm is real quick. The body farm is uh, it's the yeah. National Forensics Academy. Um, but basically, you pass away, you can donate your body to the state of Tennessee, and they take it to the body farm. And I mean, Where's this is the body farm. Um, but anyways, you donate your body to science, and they, I mean, they put people like in the river and like let them decompose. They blow them up in cars. It's like all kinds of stuff just so they can, you have these people come in from all over the world that do like body recovery and like crime scene stuff so they can figure out. Oh, you so know. They, they, they train these folks. It's creepy shit. So man. he does that, but he does, it is creepy. Uh, but he does like blood stain pattern analysis, fingerprints, all kinds of stuff. If you leave your fingerprint right here and you kill me, he'll find you. So. I, I think the worst way to die. Oh, I love this. Would be to get to get eaten by an animal. You turn into shit. <laughs> well, you got to do that. I, I turn into a turd. Well, just buy you a couple cats and die in a house, and then those cats are eat. You. Oh, you're you're out. You know, you get mauled by a bear. I you personally want to go. Shit. I want to go on a front porch. For the record, to reflect, I like to go on a front porch. Just with a swing. glass of sweet tea and just on, just, on just that's it. 